Welcome to the section developing news app using Node.js and Flutter. In this section, we will develop BBC Clone app. Why BBC? Because it's quite different. In this app, we can show featured news, we can show video news, we can show popular news, and most importantly, we can show live news. Let's test the live news. Let's start. First of all, we need to install all the packages. Let's go to browser, search for Node.js, download it, and install it. It's simply next next installation process. As I have already installed it, so I'm skipping it. After you have finished installing Node.js, run CMD and in CMD, let's write npm minus v to check the npm version. We are using 6.9.0 version of Node Package Manager. Now let's install all other packages. Let's install Express first. And for that, let's write in CMD npm space i short for install and the package name express let's install it globally to install any node package globally we need to add a plug minus g now press enter to install now let's install express generator to install express generator let's write npm i express minus generator and let's install it globally. We're done with our installation. Now let's create the Express application. For that, let's go to your desired directory, run command prompt, and in the command prompt, let's write Express space your application name. I'm naming the application news minus API, and press enter to create your application. Our application is installed successfully. Now let's go to application directory and run terminal here. And in the terminal, let's write npm space i and press enter to install all the dependent packages. And we're done with our installation. Now let's run the application. To run any express application, we need to write npm space start and press enter to run the server. Great, our node server is running. Now let's go to browser and browse localhost clone 3000. Great, we have successfully created and run our express application. Now let's go back to project directory and go to views directory. We can see the view extension is .j, but we want to use EJS view engine because it's super cool. It's easy to use. It's almost same as Blade engine in Laravel. So let's delete the project. Run the CMD again. And in CMD, let's write express space the view engine name. To specify any view engine, we write minus minus view equal to the engine name. We want to use EJS engine. We want to name our application news minus API. And now press enter to create the application. Now let's go to project directory, run a terminal here. And in the terminal, let's write npm space i and press enter to install all the dependent packages. Now let's run the node server and go back to browser and check it. Let's reload it to check. Great, our app is running. Now let's understand roots and views and bind root with view in next lesson. 